Hey everyone and welcome back to our channel. So today is day one of Vlogmas and yeah so I just kind of wanted to take you guys right now with me today. I'm about to go get tested for COVID which is why Lauren and I aren't together for this. Um, I have I was exposed to COVID over Thanksgiving break so now I have to go get tested which sucks because like I can't do anything. I have to stay quarantined. I can't go to work. I can't hang out with my friends, I can't go to youth group, I can't go to my sisters, so it really kind of sucks. But it's okay. We're thinking positively, you know, I don't think I have it. I don't feel sick. I have a sore throat, but it could just be allergies. So we're just gonna think positively. And I have to be at the testing place in 20 minutes, so let's just go to that. Okay, so now I'm freaking out a bit because they sent, just sent me a video to watch on like what to do when you get here. I have to test myself? I can't stick that up my, my nose myself. Oh my god. Oh my god. Uh, what? So I don't know if you guys are going to want to see it happen, but I'm going to record it just in case anybody does want to see it, like, to see, like, what to prepare yourself for. I'm going to record it. So they said to have my insurance card and my ID out. So that's what I'm getting out. <sighs> I am so nervous. I am literally, like, I mm, testing myself? Like, that does not seem at all accurate I'm gonna just say it like how do you know if you're getting up far enough you know <sighs> alright let's do this I think I'm good to go. Message from sister. Not bad. So it's December 1st. And we're doing something called Vlogmas. Message from sister. I recorded myself doing it for the memory. <laughs> and Tara gave herself a COVID test. Because um, I guess CVS is requiring everybody to give it to themselves. Which is kind of silly. But, um, anyway, so she was all freaked out about it. She just said everything went well, but, um, yeah, I'm kind of going to lunch right now. We've really needed, I really need the break from work and I'm going to go pick up William. We're going to go get some lunch. I have no idea what we're going to get. Um, but anyway, so I made a fake TikTok, not a fake, but a hidden TikTok. So Tara can't see it. And I'm trying to like do something and it's driving her crazy because she doesn't know what it is. So, haha. Uh -huh. um, neighbors. Um, anyway, so I, I don't know what to say. I'm talking to a camera while I'm pulling up to like my house. Um, I really want to get some of those, um, the, the molds for the hot chocolate bombs like the hot cocoa bombs or whatever i think that'd be really cool that'd be really fun and like maybe a good gift to give like co-workers and stuff i'll try to give the the people i work with um something small i did mason jars with homemade hot cocoa mix in them and that's really fun and they look really pretty but it's really complicated 
it's not complicated. It's just a lot of layers, a lot of steps, and it takes a lot of time, especially if you're doing one for everybody. I have like 20 something people and they have kids and their kids want some too. So it's like, I end up making like 40 mason jars of hot cocoa and each layer is a different kind of powder and it's just, it's time consuming. Um, and then another year I tried to make um, chocolate drizzled popcorn um, and that was really, really good, <laughs> really, really good. But again, there was a lot more popcorn that I needed to make than I realized, like 50 bags of popcorn just to make a decent amount for one person. Um, so I don't really want that either. So I'm thinking about trying these hot cocoa bombs. We'll see. Maybe I don't make anything this year. I don't know. I'm not really like set on having to make something this year, but I do need to think of gifts for more people. So I got, I have to find something for William, for something for my brother, William's parents, and that's it. Okay, everyone, so it's it for today's vlog -mas. Tomorrow's video, Lauren and I are actually going to be together for it because we filmed it before I had to get tested. <laughs> I hope you guys enjoyed, and if you have to get tested like I did, don't worry, it really doesn't hurt. I know I was making a face while I was doing it. I didn't realize I was making a face while I was watching it. It didn't hurt. It just tickled and like made my eyes tear up. So it was kind of like, oh, and um, it was really because it tickled that I was doing that. Because I was scared I was gonna sneeze. I didn't want to sneeze while I was taking the COVID test. Like that would have like made it not be able to work. So that's why I was making those faces. It doesn't hurt. I promise and I hope if you have to get tested that it comes back negative and I'll pray that it comes back negative for you guys and that it comes back negative for me but yeah we'll see you guys tomorrow bye